Here we have a standard metric tape measure. These numbers here are centimeters. We start at zero here at the hook. The hook here is loose. Have you ever wondered why the hook is loose? Stick around and I'll explain why it needs to be loose. As we progress up the tape measure, we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and the ten is in red. We then go further, and here's a twenty, and a thirty, and so on. If we keep pulling this out, we have fifty, sixty, eighty, ninety, and a hundred. There are 100 centimeters in a meter. As we look closely here, these tiny lines, there are 10 of them between each of the centimeters. We've got one, two, three, four, five. Right. And so this is the halfway point between a centimeter points. We have five more, one, two, three, four, five, and it reaches eight. There are 10 millimeters in a centimeter. When we want to specify a distance or length in a metric, let's say we're going to measure uh, this phone. Okay. I put the tape measure here. I go out to over here. So this is either 15 point, oh, that's about six or seven centimeters, or it's 156 or seven millimeters. What's interesting is I've been using the term millimeter and centimeters, both having meter in common. The metric system is based on meters or parts of meters or multiples of meters. These are centimeters, and a centimeter is one hundredth of a meter. So one hundred centimeters is a meter. A millimeter is one one thousandth of a meter. So there are a thousand millimeters from here to the end of the tape measure. As we go on, the numbers simply increase. There's 150 centimeters, 180. So there's 200 centimeters or 2,000 millimeters. I promised I would tell you why the hook was loose. It has to do with this piece of metal right here. Okay. This moves the same distance as this is thick. If you're measuring something on the outside, then the hook moves out. If you're measuring something on the inside, then the hook moves shorter. And this is always equal to this little piece of metal. I take this ruler and I place it here on top of here, like so. Watch what happens. I'll line it up. It's going to line up a little better. Okay, if I push that in and put it right at the zero right there, everything's lined up. And now, if I pull it out, it's lined up to the inside. So that moves, it looks like it moves about a millimeter. And that's why the hook is loose. I have a lot more videos. Thanks for watching. Come back again.